the escapes for that car today. Remember one of our storylines at the top of the show. Oh, look at this involving the Mike Shane Ford and one of the Salem's Masters. That's the championship leader. Remember the winners from the oh, Daytona 24 no. hour race. John Pugh uh, in a big incident there. This is a full course caution for sure. That uh, prototype car will move. be stuck. If it doesn't there. move, they're going to have to tell you how that Joe Nonamaker in the 43. Here's what happened. Here's Joe losing it to the outside on his own. No contact there whatsoever. Now he's going to come and try and get re-entered. Back on the racetrack somehow. There he's got it fired and trying to keep momentum up in that grass. See, oh, that's a big hit. Woo. Let's take you on board the 60 with John Q for that, this wild ride. Oh, that's that going to do mega that damage. Major deceleration. That'll really fold it up that front and uh, really given uh, yeah. John a bit of a hit there from the chest with a sudden yeah, he, he, sudden stop. He took a complete stop all at one time. That's just like hitting a concrete wall. If not worse, because you'd bounce off the concrete wall, he didn't bounce off a bit. Well, look how far he's pushed the soil and sod. Doing such a great job qualifying in the top five. He's running in the top five. Watch this in real time and watch how fast this car comes to a stop when it digs in. I mean, that is a brutal, violent stop. Spine, having repair from John's right. He comes through this corner through the apex. There's nowhere to go but cut across the glass. My gosh, I mean, the, the G force is right there. I'd like to see what those were. I would like not to feel them. I'd like to see them on the meter. Think about being on a bicycle, a mountain bike, or a motorcycle and just grabbing a fistful of front brake. That's exactly what just happened to John Pugh. Oh, another car. Oh, express express cars. Cars. This one's nosed into the barrier. I don't think it's hurt from the looks of things because it's gone through the gravel trap. But this is under, you, I believe. This is under full course caution this happened. Wow, I wonder if there's some confusion whether trying to get in a pit lane at the last moment or something or stay out. Let's take a look. Yeah. Wow. Uh, I think they told him to stay out the last moment. It looked like David did committed to pit lane and then maybe wow. stay out, stay out possibly on the radio. We'll have to wait and get clarification on that, but certainly he looked committed to the pit for yeah, he looked like he was going to go to the pits for sure, and then all of a sudden they either told him to stay out and he tried to make that avoidance, but 